born on the 12th of November, 1873 in Berlin, whose real name was Wilhelm Elias Singer, not William Singer, but it was Wilhelm Elias Singer, another Kazarian devil. So William Singer's real name is Wilhelm Elias Singer, the ex-husband of the creator of Planned Parenthood, Marcus Singer. His father's name was Warren Wilhelm Singer. Now, as a side note, there was another Warren Wilhelm Singer many decades, many, many, many decades later, okay? A man by the name of Bill de Blasio, our former mayor of New York City, but his real name is Warren Wilhelm. Bill de Blasio's real name, the former mayor of New York City, is one William Warren Wilhelm, the same father of William Singer, the husband of Mar You can't make this up. William <laughs> Warren Wilhelm was not only the real name of Mayor de Blasio, but his father as well. But the bloodline is connected to the father of William Singer, the husband of Margaret Singer. They're all related. In my conclusion, William Singer, Marcus Singer, was communist and socialist. I'm going to say something that's going to blow your mind, so as a side note. Remember the Statue of Liberty? That just came to my mind. The, now, the original Statue of Liberty, Pastor Sam, was a black woman. A black woman, where the French gave that to us as a gift, a black woman having a Bible in her right hand and a broken ball and chain on her left. But these left-wing communist and socialist devils did not want that in this country. So they removed that. And President Trump, when he was in office, he really hated the Statue of Liberty. Not what it represents, but, but the woman that it represents. He wanted to restore the original statue. President Trump, another topic for another day. The woman that they replaced the black woman with was a woman by the name of Emma Lazarus, who had a lesbian relationship also with a 16-year-old girl by the name of Emma Goldman, who went on, wanted to overthrow the United States government. Emma Lazarus, the face of the Statue of Liberty, was a lesbian, okay, was a proponent of black eugenics. Listen, black folk, give me your tired, your poor, your hungry, okay? Looking like a man, that's right, uh, the truth, okay? Yearning. I know that she was a communist, a socialist. It's powerful revelation, Pastor Tara. That statue has got to come down and <clears throat> put, put up the original one, not because the original one was black, I don't care what color it is, but the original one represents freedom and liberty for our country through the word of God and breaking the chains of mental slavery. So Emma Lazarus, whose father was a brutal slave owner, who the Lazarus family, including the Monsanto family, was excommunicated out of Holland in the Netherlands, forced to go to that to the United States. The Monsantos moved to New Orleans, Louisiana. The Lazarus family, when Moses, his wife, and their daughter Emma, who became the face of the Statue of Liberty, went to South America. And because of the Portuguese Inquisition, they were kicked out and were forced to move to New York City. Here comes Emma Lazarus, a proponent of black eugenics, a proponent of abortion. It was Emma Lazarus, who along with her 16-year-old lesbian protege lover, young Kazarian devil, I'm not, I'm not talking about Jewish people, I'm talking about one family of the Rothschilds, who had financed all this. Emma Goldman, who at the time 16 years old, shortly before Emma Lazarus' death, they marched in the streets of Harlem, with copies of the Constitution, and Emma Lazarus, your face of the Statue of Liberty, was tearing up the Constitution. Who does that sound like? This witch that you call your Speaker of the House, Nancy Pelosi. That statue needs to be taken down. I said that statue needs to be taken down. Because it represents communism, socialism, and fascism. Her father was a brutal slave owner. This girl, Emma Lazarus, the face of the Statue of Liberty, was a proponent of black eugenics. But you don't know because no one is teaching you the truth, but I am. Take it down, okay? It's all Illuminati symbols anyway. Now back to 